Today I'm making Mexican inspired grilled pork tenderloin sliders with an apple chipotle coleslaw. These are absolutely amazing and easy to make. So let's get started. I'm gonna need three chipotle peppers and adobo sauce and you can find these in the international aisle in your grocery store. And chipotle peppers are simply smoked jalapeno peppers. I found that three peppers was perfect for this slaw but if you like it extra spicy, add a couple more. And now you simply wanna chop these up real fine. And now add them to a large mixing bowl, along with chopped up Fuji apple, a little bit of salt, fresh cilantro, ground cumin, and mayonnaise. Now give that a good mix to get everything well combined. And for a full printable copy of this recipe and many more, visit the Wolf Pit blog. Now I'm going to add one bag of the pre-chopped coleslaw mix. You can chop your own if you like. And now give it a good mix. And if it doesn't look nice and creamy, that's okay. Cover it up, put it into the refrigerator for a couple hours, mix it up again, and it'll be nice and creamy. And now for the rub for the tenderloin. I'm going to start with oregano, granulated garlic, granulated onion, black pepper, chili powder, cumin, and kosher salt. Give it a good mix. I have two pork tenderloins, just over a pound a piece, that I'm gonna drizzle with oil. And now very liberally season all sides with the rub. Now these go into the refrigerator for one to two hours to marinate. Once it's done marinating, take it out of the fridge and let it sit on the counter for at least 30 minutes to come up to room temperature. I have the grill dome preheated to 400 degrees and set up for direct cooking. Now I'm going to grill these for about 5 to 6 minutes per side or until it reaches an internal temperature of 135 degrees. And if medium rare or pink pork bothers you, go ahead and cook it to 145 degrees. Give them a half turn at the halfway mark to give them the nice hash marks. After two and a half to three minutes, give them a flip. Now let them go for two to three more minutes until they reach 135 degrees. Once you take them off the grill, loosely tint with aluminum foil and let them rest for 10 minutes before slicing. Now slice the pork as thin or as thick as you like. It doesn't really matter with this cut because it's going to be extremely tender no matter how you cut it. And like I said before, if pink pork bothers you, go ahead and cook it a little bit longer until it reaches 145 degrees. And now let's load up the pork on our sliders. And once you think you have enough pork on the sandwich, go ahead and add another piece. And now top these off with the apple chipotle coleslaw. And there you have it. Mexican inspired grilled pork tenderloin with an apple chipotle coleslaw. These little sandwiches were absolutely amazing. Thank you all very much for watching. Please don't forget to like this video and subscribe and I'll see you soon.